Hello everyone, welcome to the presentation of the new release of the Super Trend Indicator. On this release, we have changed the signaling for the pullback. We have two different entries. We have an entry at trend change and also we have an entry at pullback. The pullbacks are signaled by triangles while the trend changes are signaled by arrows. On the new version we can disable or enable each one of the signals by itself if, you, if we are only interested in the pullbacks we can enable only the pullback signals so we can trade these triangles the, tri the triangles are located below the super trend line because this is the, the place where we usually locate the stop so we are entering short at the line and placing the stop over the triangle same for this long we are entering long at this price and placing the stop here if we are only interested in trading the classic entry the trend change we can show the arrows and we can also hide the pullback line because we are not uh, using it so this is the classic super trend let's see now some examples of using both type of signals here we have an example of a trend change on the super trend where if we enter at the trend change signaled by this arrow then we get a field near the open of the following bar and for this short we get a field in the open of the next bar of a trend reversal this is if we trend if we trade the trend change where we have the arrows but if for example after the trend change we wait for a pullback for example at this line we can configure this line on the pullback section this is currently an SMA of 17 but we can choose a different set of different lines with different periods then we get a fill down below with a much better profit potential and the same for this short let's see an example As we can see on this version of the super trend, this is the, the current version, is uh, version 3. We have arrows for trend change and triangles for pullback entries. So we can configure markers to enter long on an arrow up or an arrow down for the classic entry at trend change let's see how this works Mm-hmm. 
<coughs> Now we are trading the classic entry at the trend change Where? of the super trend. Target filled. We get a fill on the entry near the open of the following bar of the trend change. On this example, it was enough to get a target, <coughs> but we could get a much better entry at the pullback. Let's see now the short signal. Now we get a fill, it is too below, and it was a loser <coughs> because the entry was uh, too low. We could avoid this uh, loser because, in fact, it is a winner trade. The problem is that the the stop user is too small, so we can use or a bigger stop, or we can use the um, pullback entry. For that we need to configure markers to enter at triangle up for a long and triangle downs for a short. Go back again. Now we have the audio alert warning about the trend change. So we can be alerted about the next pullback entry. Have the trend change. Order filled. Target and, and filled. And now the pullback entry. Now we can use a much bigger target because we have more space. And the short now, instead of being a loser, now we see. Now it is a winner. Now we are going to have order filled the pullback fill entry. We can locate the stop even over the triangle. Same here. Target filled. And it is a winner. Thank you everyone. See you bye bye.